Hey there vape fans and welcome back to another Mount Baker Vapor Product Spotlight video. Today we're going to be checking out the Stentorian Steam Engine by Watofo. Let's get to it. So this is the box that your Stentorian Steam Engine is going to come in. Uh, really nice packaging, looks super good. And you just pull off the top where you will be presented with your manual and your fill guide along with some replacement o-rings for your tank. And you have your tank inside there and two replacement coils as you can see there. So the steam engine is a 510 threaded tank. It's made out of high quality stainless steel and glass and is, has a six milliliter tank capacity. All the coils are fitted with Japanese organic cotton and you can find the replacement coils on our website. The steam engine does feature a removable drip tip so you can just pop this one off and put your own in there or just use the one that came with it. It does feature top and bottom fill method. So this piece right here will screw off and you can see your air, your fill holes right there. It, and also right down here at the bottom, it unscrews, you can fill from the bottom as well. Inside of the tank, you can see that there's that rotating piece. And as you rotate it, the sleeve will cover the coil so you can fill it up quickly. And then once you are ready to vape, you need to make sure that you twist this back open so juice is able to get to your coil and you're not just vaping a dry coil. This tank does feature two bottom airflow adjustments and they're huge, so you'll definitely be able to find your sweet spot while you're using the tank. As I mentioned before, you do get replacement coils in your box, but if you're looking to pick up new ones from the site, we offer the Canthal coils in flat, clapped in, and parallel wires. So you'll be able to find whatever vape for flavor or vapor production that you were looking for. There's going to be a point where you're not getting the best flavor anymore from your steam engine and this just means that you need to change your coil. So just unscrew the base, un just take out this coil, just unscrew it, put in your new coil, and we always suggest that you prime your coils. So this consists of just putting juice onto the coil itself, screwing it back into your tank and filling it and you can let it sit. We also recommend dry pulls, which just means you take pulls on your tank by not firing your device, and also bring juice to the coil by capillary action. And that's it for today's product spotlight video. If you liked the video, make sure to like it and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And as always, vape for your own life.